do let it focus let it focus let it focus start good morning guys welcome back to ns vlog so today's vlog is going to be a very very exciting this is abhishek here with you and before i proceed with the vlog i would request all of you who haven't subscribed to our channel subscribe down below in red color there's a subscribe option available which once you hit you'll get subscribe and then of course there's a bell i can just beside it which once you hit you'll get notified with all our future vlogs so as i said this vlog is going to be very very interesting in fact this vlog is of our own interest so as you must have already guessed it this vlog will be about food 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 and food so guys without any further ado let's head out and go to one of the restaurants and what we're going to try there is what we're going to tell you while we are in the car on the road so let's go guys and meet you at the other end guys i must say friday is the best day to do vlogging just look how quiet it is what do you feel swagata yeah it feels relaxing and we get entire day to enjoy a lots of activities So guys we have decided to go to one of the mandi restaurants now if you don't know what is mandi restaurant or what is mandi it's uh, arabic cuisine and it is very delicious of course and we are trying it after a long time guys so we are very excited to do it it's 2 pm right now and uh, mostly on fridays all the restaurants get opened at around 1:30 to 2 o'clock so we are right on the time and of course we are feeling very hungry guys so so guys let's go to a restaurant right now and have some delicious food lunch we have ever had guys just look at the room and ambience hi must wait the option of lamb yeah hey man the hani kids the man the dora This is lamb. So guys, we've got starters right now, and as you can see, some soups are there. So Swagata is going to explain what exactly it is. So Swagata, what it is? Uh, this soup is a lamb soup. See, this the consistency of this soup. It's uh, like liquid form, and they have given as a salsa, which is a tomato puree with crushed green chilies. and of course with yogurt yeah and, and that here it is a green salad with uh, the arabic salad patta and some cucumber and lettuce this puree looks a little spicy to me no it's not a spicy because i have already tasted it it's just a puree because you have to mix it with your mandi so it gives you a great moisture Oh that sounds great guys and what we've ordered is chicken mandi and fish mandi yeah so here it is if i have to show you in the menu card this is what we've ordered so this is chicken mandi which we've ordered and then on our left hand side we have a hamur fish hamur mandi fish. wow guys this lunch sounds like a lot of fun now just look at the ambience this is a kind of a bed on which the carpet also has been put then there are a lot of cushions all around us to make us comfortable then there is a road or uh, i'm sorry it's not a road there is a door which can be closed to get us an entire privacy and then just to get swagata where is she sitting right now wow look at this wall texture it feels like very morocco isn't it yes of course and just look at the ambience guys they have given a perfect arabic ambience to it this is a zoomer and then uh, you have literally a private suite book for our lunch isn't it and look where i'm sitting <laughs> it's so comfortable you guys have you been to a restaurant sitting down with a folded legs to have lunch isn't it cool 
So now I'm going to test this starter which comes as a soup and uh, it's a lamb soup as Swagata says. So let's, let's test it. Mm, it's really amazing guys and if you happen to come to any of the Arab countries or Arab world you must try this mandi and of course the soup which comes with the mandi. It's really delicious. Now we are definitely eager to have our mandi which is expected to come in the next 20 minutes. So let's wait and watch. Mm, but meanwhile the soup tastes so delicious guys. And guys I must say it appears to be very healthy as well. It's so guys do you really feel that I am at a restaurant? Just see how comfortable I am sitting right now. It feels like you are in home. Yes exactly even to me. <laughs> Let me take this cushion behind me. So the food is here. So guys as you can see this is entire chicken piece put on the rice base so this is chicken mandi and then there's a fish called hamur which they have fried and put upon rice base is a colored rice basically which has i think what 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 all it has Swagata? it has uh, your whole piece of chicken mandi and some colored rice i think they have put saffron also for the smell yes and then this rice is going to be mixed with tomato puree which has it's uh, not actual tomato puree it's called as a salsa yeah and some spices as and well with yogurt. and then yogurt so it sounds delicious guys so let's see and let's have it around so basically this is the tomato puree which i'm going to mix it with rice and then i'm going to be putting some yogurt as well and then i'll have a bite of rice you know i'm going to break this chicken flesh but then it is very difficult to break it with the spoon and uh, i also feel these all kind of rice dishes taste well when they are eaten with hands so i'm going to forget about spoon right now just i'm going to leave it aside and then i'll continue with the hands so let's let's break our chicken flesh and as you can see it is very easy to break guys i am going to mix it with some rice i'll use some tomato puree puree over here and then yogurt as well i'm gonna mix it all and then let's see now mm. it's really delicious guys you must give a try and now i'm going to continue eating it further now let's start, let's test hamur as well. So this is a hamur piece and then because both the rice you can see are the same. So I'm going to mix it with my rice only. Then I'll put just tomato puree again, some yogurt. I'll just use spoon to pick a yogurt bite and then let's have a bite of hamur. Mm. Trust me guys, both the dishes are equally nice, equally tasty and equally delightful. Just see how it is easy to break the entire chicken guys. I can just break it in 2-3 to three minutes. It is very soft and equally tasty as well as I said. with the main course and uh, we've just finished Monday literally and then we've ordered some sweet as well now I just forgot the name of the sweet that we've ordered just let me just look into the menu card again and it is uh, I think it was on the third page yeah I just got it it's called Konafa sweet and as the picture shows it appears to be a delicious dish again so let's see how it is i think i think i had tried a konafa dish in global village which comes with cheese right yes you're right uh, even also recollect now we have yeah. tried it in global village it was very delicious isn't it the, the konafa. so this is our konafa thank you so here is our konafa which is desert guys now I really don't know what the content is but then 
it appears to be very sweet and delicious full of butter so let's let's try to break it and test it again this is very easy to break guys and it contains a lot of cheese as you can see from within mm. this is really like a my dish it's full of cheese it's full of cheese and sweetness guys you must try this dish as well can you mention the name again it's kunafa kunafa yeah. okay it's a dessert and it's the name of it is kunafa can you show this the layer of the cheese wait let me zoom it you can't really see a layer of the cheese because uh, the cheese is within mm. so as you can see there are some cheese particles so you can see on top of it i don't know with camera if you will be able to see it wait, i'll wait, just wait. try to come closer so these are some of the cheese particles on it and then i'm going to have it now mm. amazing guys amazing So as you can see right now, Sagatha is going to try it. It has some crunchiness, cheese, and some buttery taste. It's awesome. It's not that sweet as compared to gulab jamun like that. Thank you. So far, so good. I think now that we've had so much, we will have to walk. At least five kilometers extra, no, isn't it? Ten kilometers. <laughs> so five plus five, ten. <laughs> hey guys, so we're going to end this video right now, and I hope you enjoyed watching it. If you really like it, please don't forget to hit a like option, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon, and do share with your friends, relatives, and whoever you want to. And comment down below your opinion about the video, guys. To subscribe to our YouTube channel, you can click over here. And if you want to watch the previous video, you can click over here. Yes. And on this note, let's say goodbye for now. See you in the next vlog. Stay happy, stay, stay blessed, blessed, and enjoy your life. Bye bye. <laughs>